guys, my name is Beatrice, and today, since school is going to start for me, I decided that I want to make a DIY notebook. So, I don't really know um, much notebook ideas, but I decided that I would draw an ice cream. So I'm not doing this alone, by the way. I am doing this with my friend. Ow! Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Hi guys, it's me, Caramel. Caramel! Yay! be doing this DIY. I guess it's kind of like a DIY. It's just that my notebook looks green and plain. It doesn't really look that nice. So I guess so I need to help with caramel because I'm not really good at drawing. So yeah. So like I said, let's go start this DIY. And my notebook is a green color, which we're not going for. So we're going to go get some bond paper. And also we also need a pencil so basically your paper size needs to be the same size as your notebook so yeah so since we have the same size as for our notebook now it's time for me to go ahead and draw the ice cream okay so I'll draw the ice cream now so since we have two papers that are actually going to be in the front and back, I might as well design the back one. But I don't really have ideas right now, so it might be just an ice cream in a like a ice cream sundae or something. So basically, this is what I did to the drawing. It says ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. If you want, you can make it. You can turn all of these letters into calligraphy or cursive. It's your choice. So it's a pretty normal ice cream in a cone and basically Beatrice will be the one who's going to go choose of what flavor she wants and she'll color it by the color. So I'm gonna make the back one because why not? So I'm gonna draw an ice cream in a cup or something. So I made a want some ice cream if the camera could focus. See? It's called Wantsome, and then ice cream on it. <laughs> and the cherry is kind of hiding, but yeah. So now, both of us are going to outline the, our drawings into per with permanent marker, and after that, we're gonna go ahead and paste it to our notebook. Now that we're done outlining, it's, it's an um, optional choice for you to either color it or leave it here, but I'd rather color it. Okay, for some reason I did not color them by flavor because I only had a few coloring pencils so I decided just to color them with random colors so don't be mad at me that I colored them with flavors that did not exist. Well, yep, yeah, these are the finishing touch. Now that we're done with that part, we're gonna paste this into the back. Using some tape, we're going to put the tape, place it at the back, so we put two tapes in there and one is kind of broken so let's check that out shall we? so this is the back of the notebook and let's paste it at the back of the notebook is done but we haven't done the front one so let's do that okay so so now that we're done, let's go see the finish, um, result? I don't know. <laughs> you should put it with different colors. So I'm gonna make this, I'm gonna fix that later, but let's check the back. And it's kind of simple and cute. So that's how you basically make a DIY Barbie notebook. There are still a few step there are still a few um, line thingies like the inside of the notebook that has the green thing and we did not stick the notebook that well because it was very hard but 
Yeah, it was a cute notebook though. So I colored the letters, but the screen part here is not really seen, but I don't really care. Uh, so it says here, I screen, you screen, we all screen for ice cream. So basically, I just colored it with some colors so people could look at it in there nicely. So you guys can do a lot of stuff with this notebook. You, put, you can put like text and stuff. You can like um, put decorations on your ice cream, I guess. So, so yeah. So that's how I make my Barbie notebook. And I'm ready to go to school. And yeah, I hope you guys like this DIY. Thanks to Caramel for joining me today. Check out my Instagram, Beatrice. So check out my Instagram. It's Beatrice underscore Barbara doll. And please follow me there. Check out Little Glitter's Instagram. And her Instagram is still called Little Glitter Dolls with a Z. And I hope you follow her on her Instagram too. I hope you subscribe to this channel, like this video, and I hope you guys like this DIY. So, nice to meet you guys, and bye!